was really quite strange that there was all this good surf and yeah, there was no one around. I think we all went a bit feral. Alison was working from home, so she set up in the spare room. Well, towards the end of May, the lockdown came to a, a finish and we all settled down to some kind of funny routine. Yeah. Later in uh, July, I had a visit from my cousins, Rob and Moira. Addison and Lady had come back from Sweden because of the pandemic and were staying down in Queenstown at Victoria and Raphael's place. I decided I'd go down there and have another go at snowboarding. I hadn't been snowboarding for 20 years, so yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I will for another 20 years. <laughs> Well, I got time on my hands, and I got you on my mind, and the moon and the stars up above. There's a warm summer breeze blowing down through the trees, and somewhere someone's falling in love. From Queenstown, it was a quick trip to Riverton, and then back home to Waihee Beach. Peter, one of the neighbours from down the road and one of the members of the local surfing crew, he had died and so we had a paddle out in memory of him. Oh, before Christmas, Alison and I decided we'd head up north for a bit of a short break. We went right up the top, Cape Reinga, camped at Te Aputa Puta, went back down to Paihia. Love will be looking at you. So don't get down on yourself, no one don't lose your faith. Believe these words that I'm singing of, but just as sure as the day that you were born, somewhere someone's falling in love. While up north, I shot up to Church Road in Kai Tai to have a look at the old homestead. Before Christmas, Addison and Lady were at a bit of a loose end, and so we, they came and helped me paint the house. That you were born somewhere, someone's falling in love. Yeah, just as sure as the day that you were born, somewhere, someone's falling, somewhere, someone's falling, somewhere, someone's falling in love. Victoria and Jade had arrived from Riverton. We decided to hire some e bikes and go through to Pyro and through the Karangahaki Tunnel in the dark. <laughs> it was good fun. She was a level-headed dancer on the road to... March saw us out on the Auckland Harbour for the Architects Yacht Race. On the way to Montreal, where she pressed her chest against me about the time... In 
May I got to go and check out a whole lot of amazing places as part of the uh, NZIA local awards panel. A big swell hit the east coast and everyone was out marvelling at, at the big swells and, and watching the antics of, of the kids. Yeah, they were boogie boarding under the bridge. Well, it wasn't too long before the cops came and put an end to that. Amongst all the famous musicians lost during the pandemic was master songwriter John Prine. R.I.P. John. knew that topless lady had something up her sleeve. Well, she danced around the bar room and she did the hoochie coo. Yeah, she sang her song all night long, telling me what to do. Blow up your teeth. One, two. In May, the Cook Islands opened up for travellers from New Zealand. Well, <laughs> Alison and I thought what a great opportunity, so we headed off and we were really lucky because it was only open for three months and then the bubble closed again for five months. So we headed off to stay in Rarotonga. <laughs> oh, we had a great time. It was just so cruisy, but it was just nice to get away into the, into the tropics and just hang out in a really chilled out place. We'd always wanted to go to Atataki, it always seemed too far away, but well, it was too good an opportunity to miss, so we jumped on a plane and flew to this beautiful coral atoll. All too soon it was time to jump on a plane and fly back to Rarotonga, back to the Edgewater. Shouldn't complain, it was bloody, it was bloody neat back there too. We could never get over how generous the servings of the food were, it was just amazing. On any day you could drive around the island, it wasn't 
didn't take you that long, but you'd find somewhere out of the wind. Oh well, all good things come to an end and it was soon back to the drawing board. And before long, Christmas rolled around again. Go, oh, blimey. In April, shut down in May. But I know I'm gonna change that tune. When I'm back on top, back on top in June. I said that's life. Some people get their kicks stomping on a dream But I don't let it, let it get me down Cause this fine old world, it keeps spinning around I've been a puppet, a pauper, a pirate, a poet a pawn and a king I've been up and down and over and out and I know one thing each time I find myself flat on my face I pick myself up and get back in the race that's life, that's life. I tell you I can't deny it I thought of quitting, baby, but my heart just ain't gonna buy it. And if I didn't think it was worth one single try, I'd jump right on a big bird and then I'd fly. I've been a puppet, a pauper, a pirate, a poet, a pawn and a king. I've been up and down and over and out. And I know one thing Each time I find myself Laying flat on my face I just pick myself up And get back in the race That's life That's life That's life And I can't deny it Many times I thought of cutting out But my heart won't buy it But if there's nothing shaking I'm gonna roll myself up in a big ball and